Hi folks, this is my dad doing a vlog slash vlog and what I got at the shops today. Let's get started. Hello Molly, how are you today? I'm, fi I'm fine, thank you very much. Uh -huh. Do you, you volunteered to be my camera assistant for the vlogs, haven't you? <laughs> well, you wanted me to be here. Uh, did, uh, did you want to volunteer? Kind of. I wanted to watch the behind the scenes of your videos. Okay. So, first of all, we got this. I got this DVD, or sorry, sorry, Blu-ray, and I got this Blu-ray at Pound World the, the other day there, and I, it was a one pound, and it was in great condition, it was sealed and everything. Then look what happened, Molly. It fell behind the couch and it got trapped in the radiator. Look at that. Damage. Total damage. You can't see. Yeah, you show them the damage. What a shame. Yeah. And look, luckily the disc is alright, but... The box... Farewell. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> the box is a bit hard, yeah. So we need to get a new box for it now, won't we? And what's and what is this DVD called? What's it this this Blu-ray called? It is called Escape from Planet Earth. You've never seen that. No, I've never seen that. No, and I've not seen it either. But for one pound, we thought it was I thought it was a good bargain. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm so I got that one. I also got this one today. This is a, just a standard DVD, but as you can see, it was only 50p with extended version, and it is a steelbook of American Gangster, and I've not seen that one either. So for 50 pence, I thought that was a good deal. What do you think, Molly? Come see, come sir, which means 50 50. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, but feel the feel the <coughs> feel it, feel it. Do you not like the feeling of steelbooks? It's real metal. Mm -hmm. And for 50p, that's a, that is actually a pretty good good deal. Okay, but you can't watch this one because what is it? What age is it? 18. Yeah. Maybe when you're bigger. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm like 19 to 20. <laughs> uh, well, I'd also like, you know, John has got a flick cave. You know John Flickster, he's got a flick cave and he likes to show people around it. Now, I don't have anything like that, do I? No. No, but I do have a shelf. Don't I? Don't I? So, no. would you like to show people my shelf? Fine. Can you climb up on the kitchen? Right, moving. <laughs> so... <laughs> what have we got inside? My dad has a shelf and he has put all these figures that he has collected over the years. And... To be fair, it is pretty cool. It's got you, you're a mixture. Not, you're not filming it though, you're filming yourself. I know that. No, you need to show them the shelf. I know. I know what I'm doing. It's got a mixture of Star Wars and Star Trek on it. So, I'll show you. Who's that one? Uh, that's original Spock. That's new Spock, Zachary Quintus. That's Cadet McCoy, who's Judge Dredd, isn't he? Yeah. And we've got Chris Pine as Captain Kirk. And then you can show them all my... Oh well. So back here, my dad's got a Death Star that he got for his birthday and it lights up. I'm not going to show you because I might ruin his display, which he goes crazy about. Mm -hmm. So we you have... Can show them all individuals? Just screw them along and people will pull this here. And maybe like a higher view so they can see the higher view. No, I mean like down the way though, Molly. That's it, yeah. It's a nice Star Wars or Star Trek big shelf. Yeah. See, show them all there, Molly. Because what, what I'm going to just fall under the shelf. Because under here, I'm going to put maybe a shelf for my Blu rays there. Like a. Like um, a shelf for the Blu rays because. My, like a bookcase. Yeah, like a bookcase. But my dad. This is how my dad currently stores his no, DVDs. Molly, no, Molly, no, it's a. No, okay. Okay, we'll show that another time when it's a bit tidier. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so we can show that later. Let's. Okay. So we'll continue with what we're doing. Let's continue what we're doing. Shops at this shop, so I just wanted to show you guys this, which we picked up for fifteen pounds myself and Molly, and it's a Now TV. Um, two month contract. Uh huh. So we can watch any movie we want at any time. Well, not any movie, but any movie that's available on Sky. Uh, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can so see the sky on Sky. So we can operate this through our Xbox One S. And Xbox yeah. One. And you can have a quick look 
Can I have a quick look at the... It's not going to focus, but it says Sky Cinema there. Mm -hmm. So we can have a little look at that on the Xbox One when we just change the channel from Gordon Ramsay, which we've paused. Eh? Yeah. So we'll change it from Gordon Ramsay. And you can just select Now TV on the app. And you sign in. There we go. And for £15 for two months, we thought that would be a good thing to get for Christmas, eh, Molly? Yeah, because we like watching movies, but not at the same time. We like watching it. Watching our own kind of movies because my dad is more into like guts and glory and stuff. Mm -hmm. Emma? <laughs> okay. So turn them and show them. Yeah. Like, the that you can... And I'm more into like um, comedies. Okay. So show them what you can. What we can get. So you can either watch the movies live, so they're all on live on Sky. Like you'd watch all of those ones, couldn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Don't zoom in, Molly. Right. Or you can watch the Christmas ones, or box, it, uh, box sets, and you can watch Action Classic. Liar, liar, I've got that. Yeah, I know. So it's that's, that's really good. good. That's good, okay. So that that just what we got got there, isn't it, Molly? Yeah. So that's quite handy. You can do a movie review on any day movies. I quite like the sci-fi movies, though. I feel like that's the local. Oh, yeah, I've seen Juno as well, haven't I? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Star Trek, what's that? Star Trek, the motion picture. Look, all the Star Trek's excellent. Yep, all the Star Treks are there. So my dad over there can watch Star Treks whenever he wants. Okay, so we're gonna go back to my dad, but I can do that. But I'm gonna be doing a movie review on Sing or Juno or something, because mm -hmm. all the movies are pretty good. So mm -hmm. and kid friendly. Okay, so. John was speaking about this movie on one of his reviews the other day with the alternative ending and I went in to CX and I had that for £2 and it says new includes a new extended action cut with intense footage not shown in cinema so looking forward to watching that it's and also I didn't actually notice it was the three came to the 3D one but as we don't have a 3D TV we will what's it called it. it's World War Z yep Brad Pitt it's a zombie movie like The Walking Dead by any chance? Maybe. Okay, so we also got this one which I've not seen yet, but a lot of people seem to think it's good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The Life of Pi. Right, and I paid £1.50 for that one. And it's really good because like the... It's got a slip cover, you like the slip cover? Yeah, the slip cover is shiny as well, just like that. Mm -hmm. You can you see like... all the rainbows and stuff on that. You like that, do you? Yeah. Okay. For £1.50, pretty good quality. Mm -hmm. Then I've got this one here. Now I actually paid for a pound for this, but I switched out the case because the case was not so great. So it was a pound that one. So I swapped out for the This Is Forty case just because I so could get a case. There we go. And that's surrogates with Bruce Willis. Bruce Will. Bruce Willis. Willis or whatever. Mm -hmm. It's not whatever. He's a good actor. Wow. In Die Hard Christmas movies. Is he actually them? Okay, moving on. <laughs> Awkward silence right there. What one did this get, yeah? is... The first Transformers? The first ever Transformers for 50p. No, it wasn't 50p though. That's again, I swapped the cover out. Okay, so you swapped the cover out. That was a pound. Let me see what rating it is. 12. So, 12, so... Anyone 12 or above can watch it, so I can watch it, because I'm 13. Then, this is the one I did swap out the cover for. Look, I just got them because I like the 50p and the case, horrible bosses. So, we'll use, I used the better case for the movies I got there. Also got, this is 40. For one pound. 50p, because we swapped out the case. Okay. And it is extended theatrical um, version. That's what it says, with the UV code. Yep, with a UV code, but we don't know if it's been used or not. No, we don't. You see, that's the thing with second-hand shops. You don't know if they... So normally DVDs come with UV... Um, 
and you don't know if they're being used or not. And that's one really weird thing because you'd think the shots would take the UV codes out that have been used. Well, they won't know. So there you go. Yeah, and if the owners, the owners would probably take them out as well. Uh, Moving on. Okay. We have Spider Man 3 for 50p. Yeah, we got that there, but it was, yes, that was definitely 50p, that one. And John <laughs> Flicks hates this movie, but I haven't actually watched the it. The Waking of 12 time. again. Yeah, I haven't watched this for a long time, so we'll, we'll, we might have a look and probably agree with them, but uh, yeah, that's, that's the case. So I got those ones there, and that was at shops, but I actually went on to. I went <laughs> on to. Went on to eBay and I got a lot of ex rental DVDs for £11.99, Molly. That's alright because you've got plenty of DVDs there. Yeah, but there's 50 of them. 50. 50. And you've still got some on your desk. So that over works there. out what, how many? 50 of them. 15. Like, what, 20 each? Something like that. So I can show you them what we got. So this is. Is that Dread? Mm -hmm. Dread. Right, let's keep going. We'll just go through them quickly. Next we have A Single Man. Next we have Cowboys, Cowboy Aliens. Cowboys and Aliens, yeah. Uh, and then we have... G. Edgar. G. Edward. <laughs> Edgar. <laughs> then we have Purana DD. Then we have Justice. Then we have, what's that one? The Raid. The Raid. <laughs> then we have Harold and Kumar Christmas. Then we have Albert Nobbs. Then we have Midnight in Paris. Then we have No Strings Attached. Then we have the help. Then we have we. Then we have Jeff. <laughs> then we have young adult. Then we have Bell Amy. Then we have going the distance. Then we have. Take this waltz. Then we have the kid with a bike. Then we have two days in New York. Then we have a dangerous method. Then we have wedding video. Then we have what's that? I can't read that. Oh, the royal affair. And we have Hansel and Gretel the Witch Hunters. Hansel and Gretel the Witch Hunters. Then we have Real Steel. Then we have End of Watch. End of Watch. Then we have Sweeney. <laughs> then we have Lawless. Then we have Dreamhouse. Then we have Looper. Then we have Safe. Then we have the tourist and we have frozen and there's more <laughs> okay you got one of your green pocket things let's go jammed okay that's something i just read out to you guys and <laughs> okay then we have Wuthering Heights. Wuthering Heights. Then we have Top Cat. Like Top Hat but Top Cat. Then we have Project Nim. Then we have Shadow Dancer. Then we have The Possession. Mm -hmm. The Angle Share. Angels Share Molly. Oh well. Showtown. Happy Feet 2. And I love Happy Feet. It's a wee bit sad though. When the lights went out. Marilyn. A week with Marilyn. A week with Marilyn. 
the devil inside. The artist. The artist. Cosmopolis. Cosmopolis. <laughs> Holy Motors. Sherlock Holmes. The, sh the Game of Shadows, I think that's the second one. Margin Call. Mm -hmm. John Carter. John Carter. Dad's favourite. The Muppets. One more. Kermit the Frog. <laughs> then we have 13. The pause the video while we pause it. Don't end. So guys, I'm, now I'm going to show you, as promised, my dad's DVD collection. We have just tidied it up a wee bit, just to make it more video acceptable. Um, so yeah, I'm going to run you through, and I'm going to tell you, kind of, I'll explain to you when I get there. Okay, so on top of the boxes, we have the complete Superman collection, and so there's all the Superman movies. Then we have Mum's Daryl from Walking Dead. Then we have. He's guarding them, isn't he, Molly? Yeah, he's guarding the duties. We've got some accessories that come with him. His crossbow and something else which I don't know. Now on to the proper boxes. So these boxes, right, right round here. Um, there's four at the back. There's two here, there's an R2 at the back, and there's these two. Um, these ones here hold 500 DVDs, which is 1,000 DVDs. Then we have an R300. Then we have an R300 round the back there. Then we have... So that's... 1,600, but bear in mind they're not all full. We have an R300 here, we have an R300. So that's 2,020. And then here, okay. so then we have all the Christmas DVDs um, that we're gonna try and watch every year. So that's where my dad keeps his DVDs. Well, no, that's not filming this. So. Okay, so I'm gonna out outro this video right now. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe down below for more vlogs like this. Anything to say, Dad? Well, we've just bought stuff to make ourselves. Why have we bought them, Molly? To make us feel to make us feel better about ourselves and our lives. <laughs> Did it work? Mm, not really. Does making the video work? Yeah, because I can just watch the crunch after this. Okay, thank you. Right. Bye, guys.